Nebula 51, turn right heading 180. Nebula 14, Papa, turn right 245, report localizer established. The Airbus A350 freighter launched quietly not that long ago. In doing so, talks surrounding the aircraft's orders were kept also largely quiet. We still don't know how many customers have ordered the aircraft. We also don't know the launch customer. However, in the past week or so, the Airbus A350 freighter has garnered more public interest that has been vocally noted by customers. Originally, in fact, in and around April and or May of this year, Airbus made note that they would only move forward with the freighter version of their successful passenger aircraft should they see 50 or so orders before launch. This won't be coming all from the one customer, so as you can probably already imagine, seeming Airbus has confirmed the development of the aircraft, these have likely already been secured. And as described by them, they were actually already seeing over a dozen customers expressing interest. With the launch set to arrive by 2025, we're still a while away, but the signs are positive, and hopefully for Airbus, them being able to give Boeing a better run for their money in the freighter sector, which as we know has been largely dominated by Boeing. Now we've seen UPS and also that of FedEx express their interest in this aircraft. While these companies haven't outright confirmed that they will order the aircraft, they are looking at expanding their order book and fleet portfolio in the future. With the rapid rise in freight demand, especially during this pandemic, some companies are now in the position where they basically believe that their original order book is no longer adequate enough to meet with the demand they will see and are also forecasting for the next decade and say onwards. This is where the likes of the larger and rumoured Boeing 777X freighter, and of course the already confirmed A350 freighter, come into play. For a lot of companies like that of UPS and say FedEx and so forth, the A350 and 777 freighter are the two that are pitted up against each other for the future. FedEx have made note that they are looking at both these two planes I just mentioned, but have not yet made a decision, while there's also an abundance of unnamed customers doing the very same thing and just exploring the options available. I would have to say that in the coming years, as freighter companies and also freight divisions of passenger airlines place new orders, the A350 freighter and the 777X will be quite busy. Now, this is depending, of course, on if the launch of the 777X freighter takes place and say if these customers do not go elsewhere. I'd be very, very interested, though, to hear your thoughts on the interest for the A350 freighter following the confirmation that Airbus would indeed go ahead and develop the aircraft. Feel free to drop them below in the comment section. And as always, thank you very, very much for the continued support. I do very much look forward to you joining me on the channel for the next video here.